All right, guys, let's watch this and talk about it after. What happened to this phone? Um, we've been in a meeting with some clients from Cameroon and his phone spatch died, so he had to charge it. And he couldn't grant me a single card if I call him to tell him you wouldn't show up? Sorry, ma. He asked me to come pick you up. Baby, I'm sorry. Things just got so busy at work. That's why I couldn't come. If I could, I would never stand you up. As if it's the first time. Come on now. Kill the annoying part. It's not that you stood me up. It's the fact that you didn't have the decency to call me to let me know. Come on now, don't be like this now. Don't be like this. You know I'm working hard for a future for both of us. You and I. And my phone went down. But you were with David, right? Mm -hmm. Why couldn't he do it? I know you love juries. Hey. It's cold. Yep. Be fitting for a goddess. I forgive him. Thank you. How many times with that cold, emotionally unavailable man keep doing you dirty and you just keep taking it like that, Gina? He's a busy man with a busy schedule. You are lying too much from that rubbish man. You are taking too many nonsense from that man. Honestly speaking. Too busy my foot. Don't worry eh? If this disappointment continues, we'll give you the award for the most single girl <laughs> in a relationship. <laughs> yeah, he has missed a few dates. But he loves me. That's all that matters. <laughs> and I stop this rubbish. Oh, sorry. I thought I heard a um, common sense peeling itself from you. Huh? Alright guys, so today let's talk about emotional unavailability. It seems like we are getting a lot and lot more of those these days. But let's start with the definition. Emotional unavailability is just the inability for somebody to build emotional connections around their partner or in a relationship. When you are unable to build these emotional bonds and emotional connections, it's kind of hard to stick in one relationship. So it doesn't mean that they can't love. It just means that they love different. They cannot show their love. Now, what exactly causes this? Most of the times it comes from past trauma. It comes from maybe being hurt in the past. It comes from childhood experiences. It could come from a lot of things. Something like, you know, past disappointments, um, you know, fear of being vulnerable and many other issues. Now, when somebody is emotionally unavailable, it does affect the relationship because there are certain things that you expect emotions to play a role in in a relationship there are certain things that people do when they are emotionally connected to their partner now when that is missing it tends to affect a lot of things because they might be telling you that they love you but they really really can't show it and when they can't show it it tends to start affecting the other partner as you can see in the movie it wasn't that he was doing something bad or cheating or intentionally just you know i don't want to call her but he just was burying in his work and he saw that work as vital and doesn't need to be distracted so in essence he just focused on it couldn't even make a single phone call can such a person be fixed maybe fix is not the right word because you know we can fix human beings right they are who they are but if you are the partner to such a person the first thing that you have to understand is that you have to be tolerant. The next thing you have to understand is that you have to be willing to go more than halfway. So what does this mean? If you are ex normally expecting such a person to, you know, you know, meet you halfway on many things, you know, as it pertains to relationship, you got to be willing to go the extra mile. You know, if they didn't call you and they are supposed to be the one that call you, you should be okay with calling them. Hey, I've not heard from you. Hey, hey, are you okay? You know, things like that. And for you to even get there, you have to already know within yourself that you want to 
be with this person because you're gonna see the signs of emotional unavailability ahead of time it doesn't mean they are cheating it doesn't mean anything else it just means that their emotional bond emotional connectivity <laughs> is short circuit so ladies guys ladies now you know when your partner is emotionally unavailable it becomes a choice whether you actually want to deal with it or not if you choose to deal with it you got to be willing to go the extra mile in that relationship and there's absolutely nothing wrong with that if you love this kind of videos please follow subscribe share and like my name is cj and i'm here to deliver sense